Hey guys, this is Poet. So I thought I would just go ahead and show these things that came in from Diamond Press. They had a new release, and so they had the three bundle sets for um, a discounted price. And then if you use the 30% off code, you got that off as well, plus free shipping. So I was like, okay, let's go for it. The first thing I'm going to show you, though, are some things I got from... Whew, not too shabby and dies rs so let's go with dies rs because it's easier to show those so i decided to go ahead and get this lawn fawn treehouse die so you could build this little thing see how like that comes from the new release the little tea party <laughs> so cute i know i have the little pumpkin the acorn and the little teapot then um this was karen burniston's um burniston's uh, mini alphabets that she just released with this go round and i thought i would go ahead and get this because the letters are so small that you can use it on her her dies and it also had this cute little like background and so forth and then you can see she divided it up into here's your vowel so then you have a backing plate and then i'm not quite sure how she divided these other ones up but they're divided so there's that then i ordered some from the not too shabby so it came with these sequins and then all i bought this time were the two paper pads from the monthly box and the ephemera so here's the ephemera pack and i just loved the blue and the yellow so summertime bees and that's almost why I didn't buy it because I'm like, I still have bee stuff from before. Um, but it was such a cute paper pad. So I had to get it. And then they had the sunflower bees. So let's take this tape off and show you. So, so cute. So that's all I bought this go around. I did buy the stamps because they were gnomes and I just bought gnomes from... So I'm like, I don't need any more. So your sunflower beads. Look at that. And of course, you know, love blue. So. And I like sunflowers too. Yeah. That's cute. It reminds me of blue willow dishes. And then, is this where it starts to repeat? Oh. Yep. You know, like this goldy one. So cute. So I got that. And then I got the other one, which is Honey Bear. And I thought this was so cute that it was black, white, and yellow. How cute is that? And then look at the little bear. Well, like I said, I didn't get the stamps this time, but you can see how cute they are. A little always love a polka dot always okay so that's the not too shabby in dies or us so let's get going with the diamond press now look it's like what i put them <laughs> it's like what i put them so there were three sets that they released and this was on their their site not hsn so let's start with this one which is a slimline window where you can see that we've got this little banner here and show you the little they give you a stencil or template really so you can put this down and know where you're stamping so slimline window And then here's some more ideas. And then, of course, let me put that over there. Here's your actual stamps. So you get this one. Which, look at that. Retro telephones. How cute are they? Then you've got some little speech bubbles. So you got one, two, three. Three full phones and then a little cord. And then these other ones. So really cute. And they're small enough that you can use in the other um, window dies that they have. And then here's this. 
So you have these little flowers and bees and stuff. Now, in this case, unfortunately, you only got dies for the window. So it's not a complete set. Then, well, you know what I mean. And then you've got your requisite folder. I could be in a house with those folders. <laughs> yes. Yeah. All right, Diamond Press, move over there. They also had this one, which is a special note, which was kind of cute. see the little dies so you got this little envelope and this one it's a little tag good looking things here's the inspiration sheet special note how to cut the die and envelope and fold it and then this is one of those little foldy ones where it becomes a little flower and I actually have one of these that's really large from spellbinders so there's that then you have your requisite folder, always a folder, which is a good thing. And then you have your stamps. So this is a cute stamp. And then you have this set of stamps. And so the dies cut out these envelopes. So when you turn it over, there's your one, and then those are the other ones. So that's cute. And then this is the one I wanted the most because I saw how giant it was. So this is your citrus stamp and die kit. There you go. And I broke down and got it because I saw how big. So there's a reckless folder. I saw how big they were. Because um, originally I thought they were little teeny tiny ones. But you see how big the dies are. You see that. So here's my hand. So you can see in comparison. And then here are. Let's go ahead and show you this. So you've got your lemons, oranges. You can make them into limes. Strawberries and then just your other side you know your whole lot or well I guess it could be lime your whole lime or lemon and they give you some leaves and then some examples so cute oh, look at these look at these so it's huge so here's my finger and you can see the leaf and here's my hand so you can see that you know two stamps take up most of my hand so so cute and of course because of the way they're stamped you can use your colored inks instead of having two color um so oh, let's do it this way so you got your lim different size lemons strawberries some little stuff what's that i guess that's like the seed maybe i don't know i could just squeeze you so that was so cute and had to have that oh there's my little guy all right so those were the items that came in and i shall see you guys later hope you are being safe hope you are taking care of yourselves and you're just doing okay you guys so see you guys later and take it easy bye